it just it's not serving me bad bitch so like if it's not the long acrylic nails i don't want it i don't want it Good morning everyone, it is 9.05 on Friday, October 23rd. I just made my vanilla coffee protein shake as you saw in the clip before this. Um, so today I am going to do some stuff for my practicum and then after that I have class at 12, then I'm going to do some more work for that and then... Oh, I have a meeting with my preceptor and then after that I'm going to get my nails done I feel so naked without my freaking nails on I just although I did have some on a few weeks ago and my plan was to take them off because one of my nails broke and then go get them done but Nyla did not soak her nails off the last time she removed them so I ended up breaking part of my nail off on my pinky and so I had to wait for that to grow back before I could go and get my nails done but now um my nail is fine um it's been a few weeks without acrylics on but I need them back it just gives me bad bitch vibes bad bitch vibes I can't do the short nails like it looks cute it looks a little sophisticated but it just it's not serving me bad bitch so like if it's not the long acrylic nails i don't want it i don't want it so yeah i have a nail appointment later and then it's around five so after that i'm probably not going to be in the mood to cook so i will probably just pick something up on my way home i am going to finish drinking my protein shake um and go get some work done and i will check in with you all later <music> Okay, so I know I look weird. Um, ate breakfast, did some work, went to class, class is over, uh, was doing some more work. But the reason why I look a little weird right now is because I have my little headband on that I usually put on when I'm going to wash my face. Because um, I am about to wash my face. So I, I noticed this morning that like the sides of my face were a little broken out from afar in this video. Like... When I'm looking in the viewfinder right now, I don't think you can see it, but if I zoom in a little bit, even though it's slightly softening my skin, this was broken out. However, it looks worse now, and I feel like my face has a rash on it, which I really do not like because my skin has been very much clear for the past few months. Um, yeah, it just feels like it has a rash and like it's irritated and um, I did use my drunk elephant retinol cream this morning and I don't know if that has actually made it worse. So because I'm slightly paranoid, I am going to rewash my face. Um, I don't use an abrasive like cleanser on it anyway, so I think it'll be fine like if I had washed my face in the morning then wash it again at night. So I'm going to rewash my face and use the normal products that I would use in the morning, like after I wash my face, which is the Rose Toner from Fresh Beauty, the Drunk Elephant Bee Hydra Serum, um, mixed with the Glossier Hydration Serum, I forgot the exact name, and then the Belief um, True Aqua Balm um, Moisturizer, that's what I normally put on my face. Um, I should wear sunscreen every day, but I don't 
um yes i know black people need sunscreen please wear your sunscreen i'm gonna try and be a better human and wear my sunscreen um but make sure that you're doing it before you come for me first um but yes and so i i don't know my face is like itching a little bit on this side i just don't like the way it feels because yes it was i should also stop touching my face it was broken out this morning it just feels and looks worse now and i'm just a little concerned so i'm gonna try and take care of it yes it will magically be cleared by tomorrow but i do feel like the retinol is probably like playing a little role here in making it worse or maybe it's supposed to get worse before it gets better but i don't like this and if i ever do like get a rash on my face I usually can get it to go away within like a week so we're gonna go take care of this because I am not very happy right now with the way my face looks so I will be back once I am done doing my face all right y'all so I just washed my face it has a glow to it um use my normal morning skincare um products also if you're interested in seeing my morning skincare routine i will put um a link somewhere in the video so that you can go watch it um it's also in the skincare playlist on my channel but yeah i just washed my face hopefully this clears up within the next few days because i just really don't know what the fuck that shit is Ooh, sorry i said i was gonna attempt to not curse on my channel curse as much already failing but yes just did that um so we'll see what happens um right now i'm gonna go back to doing more work um actually i lied i'm gonna go to my mailbox because i got some of skipper's medication delivered the other day so i need to go get it from my mailbox there's nothing wrong with him it's just his normal flea and tick medication that he has to get like every three months so um i'm gonna go pick that up from the mailbox um but then after i do that i am going to do some more work um then i have a meeting at four that i probably will take over the phone i feel like we should be done before 4 30 and i kind of need to leave by then because my nail appointment's at five i already ordered my dinner for tonight so today is one of my free meals um i'm getting some calamari pizza and a caesar salad for dinner so i'm very excited i placed my order in advance so by the time i get out of my nail appointment i can go pick my food up because guess who wasn't cooking when she came home from her nail appointment nyla i was not cooking um so yes i got my food um for later and then um yeah that's kind of it for right now all right y'all i just got here and just parked in the little parking deck so i'm about to get out go get my nails done i'm not taking y'all in with me but as soon as i come out and get back in my car i will show you uh oh what they look like all right y'all i am back in my apartment finally i just walked skipper he's eating now and now i was about to eat so i got a margarita pizza i got a small caesar salad and then in here we got some let's see if i can open this with one hand some calamari Ooh, these are like thin i like this mm, they're good too so i'm about to eat oh yeah to show you guys my nails come on camera they look so good for those that know me let's flip for those that know me y'all know i am a stiletto bitch but because of what i wanted on my nails not the ombre the designs it looked better on this um i need my camera to zoom it looks better on this shape versus um stiletto so that's why i got i mean 
Yes. So that's why I got coffin slash ballerina. Um, but okay, enough rambling. I'm about to go eat now because the bitch is hungry. Good morning, beautiful people. It is Saturday, October 24th. It is about to be 8.50. Um, I just walked Skipper, fed him. My skin's also looking a tiny bit better, but we're working on her. I have to TA for that class. So before I do all of that and start teaching, um, I am going to make me a um, iced coffee with some cold brew. Um, let me make this iced coffee and then head into class that starts in 10 minutes. from Trader Joe's so we're going to do a Trader Joe's haul and if you hear any talking in the background it is because I am on FaceTime with my mother you can talk I just needed to say that part and I didn't need any interruption they switched to plastic bags because there's a paper bag shortage right now um, wow so, some broccolini, I need to move that up, got some broccolini, we're going to turn this this way so that when I show it to you, it will show it to the camera, there we go, ugh, okay, broccolini, no I didn't, I got some beef bolognese ravioli, brown chicken buffalo style chicken sausage this is new so I want to try it um, ground beef 90% lean only 10% fat I got beef stew meat you gonna make that maybe some? no uh is that the soup? no Beef soup. Um, yeah. I got some butter lettuce. I got some baby arugula to put in my salad slash sandwiches. That's what it smelled like. I was like, something smells like fish. The fish. Duh. Got some salmon. Nothing in here is leaking, right? No, that's just water. Okay. Look at that. We got some blueberry muffins, my favorite. We got two cans of non uh, nonstick extra virgin olive oil spray. I got some lemonade, sparkling lemonade. We've got some applesauce, because I am a child, and that's what I like for snacks. <laughs> got another thing of applesauce. Bags of pasta. Their pasta bags are only 99 cents. Really? That's really good. I got this bag of six peppers. How, how much is that? It was... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Broccoli. The six pack was four forty nine. Are you kidding? And I, I paid four dollars, three ninety nine at Publix for three. Some jasmine rice. I got some hot chocolates. 
because you know it's getting cold. You know that hot chocolate that I took out for you that you didn't try? Yeah. That mine is, is it good? delicious, Nyla. Some red peppers. Red onions. I mean red onions, thank you. Buffalo chicken dip. Wow. Theirs is pretty good. Um, my 2% milk, per usual. I know some of y'all think it's, you know, fashionable to have, to drink, you know, non-cow's milk, but that shit does not irritate my stomach, nor does it break my skin out. So Nyla will always drink milk that comes from a cow. I don't want that garbage that is made from plants. It tastes like dirty dishwater. Um... I got some broccoli. Now on to the fun stuff. We got some salmon burgers. Oh wow. Is it Trader Joe's, right? I like Trader yeah. Joe's. We got some chicken chili lime burgers. Those are good. I've had those before. We got one of my favorite pizzas. Those are good. Um we also got my other favorite pizza, the barbecue chicken pizza. Um, we got the chicken pot stickers. The pork ones are also good, but I don't eat pork as much anymore. These are lemongrass chicken sticks. So we'll see how these are. This is new that I've never seen before. Buffalo style chicken poppers. Oh, wow. So, we'll see if those are good. And then, tortilla chips for my buffalo chicken dip. This is more pasta. More rice. If you come from a Puerto Rican household, rice is a staple, so always have to have it. Um, and then we got some tomato sauces. This one is chunk, spicy, chunky tomato and pepper pasta sauce. And this one is marinara sauce. These were like the only two at Trader Joe's that did not have soy in them. I don't know why a lot of the pasta sauces have soy there, but since I'm allergic, can't eat that. So I didn't get those, but I've had the marinara sauce before and it's really good. And then I got some flowers. Oh, nice. What are those purple ones? Those are pretty. Um, hydrangeas. Oh, wow. They're nice. both hydrangeas. And then, oh no, you're falling. And then I got some sparkling water. So, this is the Spindrift brand. I've had it before, but never the blackberry flavor, so I'm trying it for the first time. But I have had the lemon flavor, which is the other one that I bought. Um, and so, I like to have those sometimes, trying to increase my water intake. Um, and yeah, that is everything that I bought. So I'm going to put everything away now and then I'm going to have some dinner and I will talk to y'all later. Good morning, beautiful people. So it is Sunday, October 25th. It is 9.38. So, um, I didn't check in yesterday after I ate my dinner, but I just watched some YouTube videos and was FaceTiming my best friend and then I went to sleep um Skipper what are you doing um anyways I walked Skipper I sped him I did my morning routine um and so I got a text this morning when I woke up that my Sam's Club order is ready for pickup so I'm gonna go pick that up I only got um dish detergent some turkey bacon because the Sam's Choice one that they sell at Walmart and then this um, brand of turkey bacon that they sell at Sam's Club are my favorite. So since I needed to get some other stuff, 
I was like, I'll just get it from Sam's Club instead of going to Walmart. Also, I have to go to another store, and so Walmart would be out of the way. Um, so that's also why I um, got stuff from Sam's Club, but I got, yeah, the turkey bacon, the dish detergent, I got some lotion, and... Ooh, some lemonade because I freaking love lemonade and if you're familiar with the store Earth Fair Which they closed down a lot of their stores if not all of them, but apparently they are reopening but they have the best freaking Lemonade that I've ever had in my entire life and nobody comes close to their lemonade But guess what? My best friend she tried this lemonade from Sam's Club and she said that it's basically as good as Earth Fair so I bought it because it came as a two-pack and if she's lying to me we're going to have an issue because I'm telling you Earth Fair Earth Fair's lemonade is like top tier so I need Sam's Club lemonade to come correct okay um so yeah, that's what I got from there. And then I have to go to compare or, or compare as my mom calls it sometimes. Um, I need to get sofrito ingredients. Um, I already have bell peppers and red onions because I bought some yesterday. I have minced garlic. I always have some in my fridge. I have olive oil. Um, I just need culantro. I need these other kind of peppers. I forgot what they're called. Aji se dulce, I think that's what they're called. Um, but I know what they look like. And I feel like I wrote something else in my grocery list on my phone. So when I come back from the store, I'm gonna make my breakfast and then I'm gonna put some things in the laundry. But then I'm gonna show y'all how to make some sofrito which is the base seasoning for a lot of puerto rican dishes shout out to rosa ruiz my wonderful mother for teaching me how to cook at such a very young age but over i think like maybe within the past two three years is when i actually started making my own sofrito so i'm very proud of myself that i know how to make it now if you follow me on instagram i do have the recipe saved in my um one of my food highlights on my page but i'm gonna show youtube how to make it now and then you'll always have this video to refer to or my instagram highlight um so yeah let me go
y'all back to check in so yes i have my little scarf on i'm not going to sleep right now or anything but i just put it on because then i don't have to do it later but i where did we last leave off i think it was me making my breakfast so i made my breakfast i've been doing laundry all day i cleaned in here i made the sofrito which you saw in the previous clip. I will check in with y'all when I am about to prep my dinner. Just fed Skipper, so now it is time to make my dinner. I'm trying these beef bolognese ravioli from Trader Joe's. I also sometimes like to have like these raviolis or tortellinis with like an Italian sausage, but I don't really eat pork anymore. Not like that anyways. I don't really buy it except for like a uh, deli meat, so ham, and then I have pork like um, for special occasions. So for, like for holidays, my mom makes pernil, which is Puerto Rican roast pork, or like during New Year's, I have pig's feet. Um, and if I go out for like breakfast, I might want to have some bacon, but other than that, I don't eat pork like that anymore and I don't buy it. Um, so we got some chicken sausages and this is the first time I've seen these spicy ones at Trader Joe's So I'm excited to uh, try it. I feel like I need to eat some vegetables today So that is why we are putting some spinach in our pasta and then some good old marinara sauce. So Let's get cooking so I'm back I just had my dinner I did not meal prep today I might have the same thing tomorrow that I had today but I don't know yet but I did not meal prep um but yeah I am going to uh take one of my Gymshark sets out and put it on my counter on my counter on my dresser so it can be ready to go for me at 6 15 in the morning so I can do my workout side note Gymshark I've been tagging you in my instagram post several times i know you have to have seen them at some point so in case you know you happen to stumble across this video sponsor your girl please i'm a fan sponsor me um okay back to the regularly scheduled vlog um, going to put my Gymshark set out on my dresser so that it will be ready at 6.15 when I wake up to do my workout. This will be week two of me getting back on track with my workouts and my nutrition. Um, what else? And then after I do that, I'm just gonna like watch TV, chill out, relax, um, and then go to bed and get ready for the week, the semester. For those, again, who are new and don't know, I am a grad student um, getting my Master of Public Health at UNC Chapel Hill. The semester, baby girl, she's over, basically. Like, the end of the semester is November 17th. That's in, like, what, two, three weeks, two and a half weeks? The semester is, like, basically done. Um, and so I just have a few like last minute assignments to do in terms of school but yeah that's winding down like it's all winding down and you know coming to a close so yeah but i appreciate y'all for watching and you know coming with me virtually um on my little weekend didn't do much um just ran errands really and got my nails done um because covid where the fuck am i going nowhere um so yeah thank y'all for watching i appreciate y'all so much don't forget to like comment and subscribe also hit that bell notification so you can be notified every time i post a new video because i'm sure you don't want to miss it it's great here we love it here come join the family you know you want to be a part um so yeah i'll talk to y'all in the next one